All right, guys, we're back with my darling Sonar, who just loves me. And if you said, what approach do you take with the Great Danes? The baby dinosaur, you know. Oh, Jesus, Sonny. Yeah. If you said, what kind of athletic, these things, are, they're extremely athletic. If you said, well, what they were originally bred for was war dogs or whatever. Yeah, no, I could see it. That one Shannon had. Boy, he'd have to keep it one day, because I don't know. FDA was coming to its the Department of Agriculture or something was coming to inspect and she couldn't have the dog there, so I had to keep it for the day. Uh, and I, think it just, I got it in the kennel out there. It was standing on its back legs. I mean, it was about a foot and a half taller. I, I mean, we were looking at this thing like, God, and if it wanted to tear your throat out, there wouldn't be anything you could do. You know, generally they are more mild in manner, but... You've got to approach it, you know, any any type of, if you said they're not going to retaliate from what they consider an unfair correction. No, I think they would. I think they would. Oh, hi, Timothy. Yeah, no. You know, people need to understand, if your, you know, plan is to kind of jerk or do whatever one of these, yeah, that's, that's not going to go good. You, and what kind of handler do you need to have for one of these if you said, well, you have to have a pretty good handler. I mean, you better have an electronic collar. I don't even think it's an option. You know, if you said, well, I'm stronger. You're stronger than a Great Dane? <sighs> someone's going to have to go in because someone's ruining the Zen. <laughs> She's all over me. So I've got my, you know, and I'm just saying to myself, I, I can. You have to understand, once the leash is on there... If you're doing, you know, if you said, well, you should teach it to give... Yeah, you should teach it to give in to that real fast, as fast as possible. If you said, why, well, it, you don't want it pulling you down. <laughs> oh, you're awful. So, same thing. I'm going to get the collar on. I'm not looking at the dog. If you said, you seem like do it the same way with all of us, yeah. You said what? I don't want a bunch of <laughs> that. <laughs> you said you been... I know, I should have been faster. If you said what time frame? You got about oh, and then she gives me the shake off. She's absolutely awful. Hi, go ball. Oh look at her. Huh. She already did. she thinks she's supposed to jump over the other dogs. So I can move her around with the collar and I can already see I'm gonna have to buckle it tighter. And you see, all I had to all I had to do was just either put it in the hole and get out of there. If I would have had to buckle the legs all through this crap here, the dog would have been biting in my arms. <laughs> She's unbelievable. She is a tigger. Oh, I'm totally getting her a tigger costume. Totally getting her a tigger costume. So, you know, I've got to be able to get the dog in motion. And she can do the pattern. They're very athletic. If you've never seen one of these cover ground, you're in for a treat. Because <laughs> wide open, they if they've got that stride wide open, they're, they're covering an enormous amount of ground. That's why, the, you know, that's why these side hounds have like such long legs. Once they go wide open and start throwing leaps in there too, you know, if they're leaping forward, you know, all right, so here's my pattern. Let me see if I got my chalk. Hang on.
What I'm saying to myself is if I'm gonna have a dog that heals, it's gonna have to do it. It's gonna have to know the steps. If I could find my other color chalk. The yellow line is the handler, the inside line. Hi, Leanne! The inside, yeah, you need to draw this on the sidewalk too, Michelle, because I'm already teaching it to uh, Penny. That's the handler. The handler has to, if you said the handler has to turn in, yes, the handler has to be able to turn around within this circle. You have to practice it. And the dog is here. This is the dog. The dog is out here. The dog is on the outside. It's just giving you a frame of reference. The dog is traveling obviously faster because it's on the outside. That was the old AKC figure eight thing. Oh, the figure eight. You always had to do a figure eight. If you saw what practical application. That doesn't have any practical application other than just teaching the turns. And you're better off to teach it this way. If you said why. It's better off to teach one. Te teach it as two basic turns. So teach one turn and then teach the other one. So the yellow line, the inside line is the handler. The dog is deaf. So I might have to get rid of Sunny. All right, come on, Sunny. Ah! You're going to have to go. You're awful. The goat on the platform is a default. If you said, how much do you have to reward it once it becomes a default? Not that much. <laughs> it doesn't seem like that much. Not even in the dark, she'll barrel towards those platforms. If you said, what do you do? I, if I've got something, I go over there in the dark and give her something. Okay, so this is me. I was doing the pattern before. So, you know, you said, well, how's that teaching? Well, that's teaching her, it's step by step. It's teaching her how to heal. So I want to be able to say to the dog with the pager, I can make you go faster. No, I'm trying to slow you down. <laughs> and then put a little stop right there. see you jump. No, oh, that wasn't very good. <laughs> so that's what you're thinking of. So if you said, well, how's that going? You can put this turn anywhere. So I can go way down there. As long as she thinks that turn is ahead of us. If you say, well, what, what if it just thinks you're just going nowhere? Yeah, that's where you're starting to get into a bind. <laughs> this thing's just randomly going nowhere. When people just walk with no deliberateness, I'm using this hand to indicate deliberateness. All right, I need to get her to start backing up. Just get it to happen organically. Yeah, oh, you gotta put a reverse on one of these things. You gotta put a reverse on it. So you're just kind of making it happen organically. about this dog. Oh, she's a total pain in the ass, too. She's a total pain in the ass. Oh, she just keeps me... Oh, I just wait on her hand and foot. Oh, yeah. yeah, yeah. I have it all. Thank God for Amazon warehouse deals with her appetite. So, I've got a couple things I can do. I can do a recall. If it's looking at the handler, I can get her onto the platform. <laughs> I don't have any reaction.
reaction to the barking. So I pushed her up there with the painter. All right, let's do the pattern again. Now she's looking at my. I'm I'm traveling with my upper body. I'm traveling forward, even though. <laughs> Oh, you're gonna get dizzy doing that one, but if you said I don't like the don't like that footwork, it's, it's she's throwing in little tippy taps and stuff with her feet. She's trying to make it fancier, so I can do I can get her to come to me. You didn't let me out of her sight. And send her away. Fancy, fancy feet. And I think you're gauging that. You know, if you don't have any fancy footwork, the dog's probably not enjoying it. If you said, give me an analogy, skipping, skipping, when people start skipping, that's a sign of happiness. Your gait, you're, you have a different gait if you're super happy. Am I wrong? When I see the Amazon packages getting there, I start skipping down to the gate. I start skipping, saying, my packages are here. Yeah, you got the idea. So, you know, that's who she is. All right, let me go get her dumbbells, because, yeah, oh, no, she's trying to open the toy box now. Remember my safety vault to store all the, the toys and stuff in? Yeah, no. No, that didn't work with her. Mm -hmm. Yeah, she said, what's that? Oh, that's her breaking into it. Uh-huh. <laughs> yeah, well, you see what we got. <laughs> She's going to take him to that platform. Watch. Oh, am adorable. She's gonna be in the Christmas skit. Can you believe that, Chelsea? <laughs> yeah, she did. She got him and brought him to the platform. Yeah, now she's getting in there. Now that could be the new thing with her. And we said that one can't open. Can't open a cabinet. Now she broke it. Awful. All right, hang on, let me grab some more treats. Oh, how absolutely awful. But the bottom line is she got me the keys. <laughs> So, the good thing about one like this, if you need heavy lifting, if you need heavy lifting, this is the dog for you. So, you know, if anything, oh, hi, Karen. Yeah, if anything if it was designed for this dumbbell, it's this dog. <laughs> so, 
So I think you do have to go by weight. And obviously, if you're just shaping the behavior, you need something as light as possible with easy to pick up. And then, da, 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 da. <laughs> oh, she's perfect. So she understands the task is put it in my hand. The thing about these, you have to be careful. Oh. If they drop it on your foot, it really hurts. <laughs> oh, she did it perfect. Yeah, Chels, my little fail safe, toy safe. Didn't work out. All right, so now I can get her. She'll go get stuff. Oh my God, she got two at once. All right, so she's gonna have to go back. No, she goes right back. That's gonna have a problem at all. That's easy for her. Yeah. Yeah, no problem for her. Okay, hang on, let me get a little bit harder. Checking, double checking. Oh, she can't wait for Christmas. I've already ordered her all kinds of stuff. Precious angel. You precious, precious angel. Oh, how convenient. Don't look at her though. She, oh, she, hurry up, hurry up. Yeah, she needs to be paid. Yeah, yeah. yeah she wants to be paid right away. All right, two more things. They're very easy to get her to go away. Oh, you precious, precious angel. Oh, she double checking. Oh, double check, double check. <laughs> All right, there's one more thing. No, she didn't see it. She's going to have to go back and look. She doesn't have a good eyesight. She used her nose. She did use her nose. And if you said, what was she smelling? The glasses? No, I don't think she was smelling the glasses. I think she, what she was smelling was where my hand touched that a second ago. Where my hand touched. If you said, well, look at my hands. Look at my hands. They're covered with this stuff. So my hand touching the thing was what caused her to smell it. She didn't see it. She does have bad eyesight. Uh, you know, you need to know that. If you said that was, it wasn't a refusal at all. And if you said, what does that teach him? It does teach him to look more closely, you know, to look more closely. If you said, well, oh, I all the time. I've, I already look there. I swear. I thought I, I, thought I already look there. <laughs> I was really there the whole time. You know, I guess it's uh, you teaching him a double check or something or to have faith in you that I'm not some, you know, here it is. I'm not some idiot. It's just looking at nothing. <laughs> anyway, all right, guys, hang on. I got to move this phone out of the sun before it, oh, my God, it's already overheating. All right, I'll be right back.